Welcome back, guys. I know four weeks ago I said I was going to start posting every week, and it's four weeks later, and I have not posted every single week. I'm just a loser, okay? I'm a loser. Anyways, guys, um, I'm here to talk about something very interesting today. I just remembered that we had an unfinished project, guys. This is something I hold dear to my heart because it was a very uh, very hardworking... I don't even know if I'm speaking English. Um, it was just, we put a lot of work into this short film, okay? We only had three days to film it, and we filmed like six hours a day in a forest. It was hot. It was last year, guys, in August, I think, or September. It was really hot outside. I had to wear a suit because of my role, and it was just really hot, okay? I love the storyline. Me and Daniel wrote the storyline together. As you guys know, it was last year, and it's... It's still not out. I'm talking to you guys about this because I don't think this uh, short film will ever see the light of day. Um, I think it's just a project that we worked on for nothing. But anyways, guys, basically what happened is last last year, probably around this time, um, we filmed a short film. Me and Daniel wrote the storyline. Um, and we went out and just filmed it, basically. We only had three-day period because Daniel lives in Miami, so he came and visited for, like, three days. So we only had three days to film. I want to say it was three days to film, or maybe four. It was hard work, okay? Put a lot of work into this film. Um, I don't think we ever came up with a name for it. We After we finished, we gave it to Daniel to edit because he was in film school at the time, so he's way more experienced with all that. So he went home, and he just never got to the project. He's a super busy dude, even to this day. It's probably still on his computer, hopefully, because... It was a really good uh, film. It was really good. I mean, the storyline's not the best. Obviously, it's our first legit short film. If you guys have seen my old ones, they're not as legit. This one was way more... We took it way more serious. Uh, Daniel had to make a preview because he wanted to show someone his potential, what he could do or something like that. But he sent us all, everyone that was included in the film, he showed us like a little preview of it. So I have it on my phone still and I was thinking, man, I'm like, bro, I need to make a YouTube video. And I'm like, bro, I could just show them my unfinished project. Before we get into it, I want to refilm it. If we do get the chance, I would love to refilm it because I don't know who in the world let me go into the world, right? looking like how I look in this short film. I don't know if you guys love me. I don't know if my parents love me. I don't know if my friends loved me because I don't know how people could let me look like that. I don't know how I was even able to walk around in the world looking like how I look. Basically guys, I play a villain in this short film before we get started. So don't judge my acting. Uh, I hope I did good. Hopefully I did good. So let's just get right into it and uh, let me know your opinions. Like I said, don't judge me. I look like a fruit. Did, did, just don't judge me, please. I'm going into it. One rule. You answer my question with all honesty. Question. What is your greatest sin? How am I supposed to- No! Wrong answer! You're testing my patience, Ezra. Cradshaw. How do you know my name? I know everything about you. Open the box. Where'd you get this? Remember, don't you? What happened here, Ezra? Get him! Why are you showing me the this? Answer the question. There's nothing I could have done. Wrong answer, Ezra. I was scared! Now we're getting somewhere. Continue. She needed my help and I did nothing. What are you, Ezra? No. I said, what are you? Say it louder. I'm a coward! And the truth shall set you free. Well, 
Ezra. It was fun, but I have to go for now. I'll see you soon. Wait for me. Do do do. Do do do. do. So what'd you guys think? Was it good? Yeah guys, that's that's it. As you guys can tell in the little preview, there's like a lot of um, things, there's sound effects that cut off and stuff. It's just because it was just a sample. It wasn't anything serious. As you guys can see, we took it super serious, like our shot. We were there for a while. Let me tell you, it was like 90 degrees and I'm wearing that suit. I don't know if I'm sweating in it, but I was sweating, guys, like crazy. It was it was a very cool experience. Um, it felt real legit. Like I felt like I was in a production. Everyone did super well. Hopefully, maybe we can refilm it, or maybe you know we don't have the time and we could just edit that short film and actually make it. We have all the footage we need. But yeah, guys, um, that's pretty much my video for this week. I know, I know, I'm trash. Uh, leave a like on this video if you did enjoy. Let me know what you thought about the short film, if we should release it or if we shouldn't, if I should refilm it because I look like a fruit or maybe I don't. I think I look horrible, but you never know, right? So, um, go hate on Daniel for not editing the video because we really, really want to see it, right? Or maybe we want to refilm it. I don't know. But anyways, I promise, guys, I'll catch you guys next week. And once again, my name is Gabriel, a.k.a. Billfire, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.